Despite Doom's 28th birthday being just around the corner, it's a very easy game to play online even in 2021. This tutorial will show you how. If you buy Doom through Steam, GOG, or if you download it from elsewhere, these are the four files you'll want to look for. The next thing you'll need are the three multiplayer focused source ports. These are Zandronum, Zdaemon, and Otomex. I have links in the description so you can easily click and download all three. I recommend having a main Doom folder somewhere on your hard drive and having these three source ports in their own subdirectories of your main Doom folder. Once you have your ports installed, be sure to place a copy of the IWADs in each one's folder. After that, you'll want to download Doom Explorer. This is a server browser for the multiplayer Doom source ports. I'd install it in a subdirectory of your main Doom folder, just like you did with the three source ports. Now that everything's installed, run Doom Explorer. It'll give you the option to search or import, but if this is your first time, just hit cancel. After that, click the options button at the top left. Under the general tab, I suggest clicking start from multiplayer page. Under the refresh tab, untick the automatically refresh servers button. You can refresh at any time on your own, so automatic refreshing is a needless strain on your connection if you have crap internet like I do, so I just untick it. Under the Tables tab, click the additional Sort by Players Number box. This pushes servers populated with players to the top of the list so you can most easily find games that are currently active. Under the Programs tab, you'll set the locations for Zandronum, Zdaemon, and Otomex. Click Add, and then click the three dots to the right of the Path field. The first one prompted is Otomex, so we can easily find it in our Otomex folder. Click OK, then click Add again, and repeat the process for Zandronum and Zdaemon. Under the WADs tab, click Add. Here, you select a folder where Doom Explorer will look for your Doom WADs. I suggest making a dedicated WADs folder in your main Doom directory. Under the WAD Download tab, you'll see WAD Download Path. This is where Doom Explorer will place new WADs that it downloads from the net as you join servers. Servers are usually hosted with custom content, so this is a necessary step. You should set your WAD download path to be the exact same folder you selected under the WADs tab, which for me is my main WADs folder. Once you click OK, Doom Explorer should bring up a list of populated servers. Click the Players tab at the top to sort from most players to least players. Click the Ping tab so that empty servers are sorted by connection quality. Finally, Click the small Sort by Ports button three times until the green arrow disappears. This means all ports will be listed alongside one another, making finding a low ping server on all three source ports very easy. The final step is to click the ZD Board tab at the top. Zdaemon requires accounts since it tracks EXP and Deathmatch and Dual servers, and you can easily enter your desired name, password, and account blurb here. Click New Account to make your account. Now you're ready to play Doom. Click back to the Servers tab, find a server that looks fun, allow Doom Explorer to download the WADs, and once it's complete, it'll automatically launch the server and you'll be in and ready to play. I hope this tutorial is easy for all of you out there and better to follow than my old one, which is kind of rambling and long-winded. I wanted to get a newer version put out, so I hope you guys enjoy it and we'll see you around here again soon.